Yesterday we had our meet and greet, Brownwood Paddock Square here in the Villages, Florida from 8 to 10 in the morning. We had, at one time we had 20 C8 Corvettes in the parking lot. Great, very, very uh, fun time. Met a lot of new people that I haven't met before. Very, very nice. Um, but we had a great time yesterday. Um, we're looking forward to another one soon, maybe next month. We'll keep you posted about that. But today I wanted to bring you a little look at all the different Corvette owners and what their cars are like and how they design their cars and the way they wanted their car and their Corvette. It's pretty cool. And so let's take a look at some of the Corvette, the C8 Corvette owners that we met yesterday. Okay, we're looking at some of the cars here at the C8 meet and greet here in Brownwood, Florida. And we've got some nice Corvettes right here. We have some really nice Corvette people. And uh, I'm going to ask where, your name and where you're from. My name's Al, and this is Sarah Theriel. And I, we're from Connecticut. Oh, all right. And uh, we live in the village of Winifred. Okay. Oh, very good. Very good. Uh, how do you like your car? Oh, I love it. The best it's thing, great. The best <laughs> thing I ever did was buy it and get it at the museum. Oh, and you got yeah. it at the museum too. That's yeah, a great. That's a great deal. Was, well, well worth it. It's well worth it. You're oh, right. yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and yeah. Uh, the car looks great, and your color is matrix gray, ceramic matrix gray metallic. Yeah. Beautiful, beautiful color. Thank I'm you. just going to take a quick video of this Thank you. The car. Please. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah. Love the red black interior. That looks really nice. Beautiful, beautiful. We are with the guy with the great shorts. <laughs> <laughs> Always, Tom Swears. <laughs> Hi, Tom. It's nice to see you here today at the uh, first meet and greet, C8 yep, meet and greet. Yep, yep. I, we're having a great time here, so thanks for coming. And you got a beautiful red Corvette over here. Yes, I was the first one in the, the club to get it, and probably That's the right, second one in the villages. Wow. And I've had it since March 19th, a uh, year and a half ago. So, wow. Yeah. Uh, it looks great. I hear there's something really special uh, under the back hatch. Yes. Can we take a look at that? Absolutely. All right. Okay. Absolutely. Let's take a look at this. This should be really good. All right. Beautiful color. All right. We'll stand back. This should really be spectacular. Oh, yes. Beautiful. Look at that. Tell this me about that. Well, this was all done by uh, Chris Cruz, uh, Chris Cruz Artistry in DeLand. And, uh, the, the key here is that I wanted a, a, a patriotic scene, but the other thing that I noticed when I got the car is that this whole back area, when it came from the factory, was just kind of a, a darkish black plastic yeah. uh, just yeah. out of the molding machine. And any work that I was going to have done would look awful. So I, what I did is I had Chris take the top off and strip things out. And all this black area back here has all been painted carbon flash black. So he did oh, that. Yeah, 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 he, yeah. he did that before he did all of the work. Then, then he did yeah. the work, and this is all done by by uh, um, uh, what do you call it? Uh, yes, yeah, spray, uh, airbrush. spray yeah, br airbrush. It's yeah. all airbrush. Oh, beautiful! And um, oh, beautiful. He he was able, fortunately, to take the the engine cover out and do that outside. But this this he had to do inside the car. So, uh, but wow. uh, it came out it came out looking very nice. I'm pleased with it. Uh, but the the, the carbon flash paint job in here yeah. really sets it up. That I uh, hope you can see it on the screen folks. This is beautiful with the carbon flash painting on here and the beautiful American flag on the engine cover and on this side getting a little color feedback here. Let me try it from here. Okay, that looks a little better here like that. Yeah, that looks that looks really good. Tom, thank you so much. Yeah, beautiful car. Thank you so much. Well, thank you. Yep. Thank you. We're with Wayne. Tell us about your car, Wayne. Beautiful. This color is spectacular, by the way. This is uh, Accelerate Yellow, which is, uh, I think, 2% of the total color of the Corvettes last year, and I don't think it's increased any this year. So it's, it's a, let's say, a less chosen, maybe more rare color. Yeah. And, uh, but Accelerate Yellow all by itself is a little bit overwhelming, so I put uh, the black racing stripes yeah, on it. That looks good. Nice touch. Up. Very, very nice touch. Yeah. Let me just get some video of this. It's really beautiful. And, and Wayne, what did you do to the inside here? The inside was originally going to be the natural, fully dipped uh, tan, 
and when it came time to make the final choices on the car, this one had just become available. This is called uh, Sky Cool Gray with black and strike yellow. And wow. this is actually, the, this car, the way it sets right now with, uh, with the yellow, with the racing stripe, with that interior and with the yellow calipers uh, is actually what their GTLM special edition is planned for next year. It's a, it's a $6,000 option. Wow. Uh, wow. And I love the wheels. Yeah. Yeah. This is the uh, Trident in a sterling silver. So it's not shiny bright chrome, which is what I would have preferred, but it's as yeah. close as Chevrolet does for no, that, shiny that looks bright very, chrome right now in a Corvette. That's very nice. Beautifully done. That really looks nice. Okay, we're here with Paul today. And his beautiful ride, his C8 ride, is an Arctic white with uh, it almost looks like a smoke gray black interior with I love the red stitching on the seats and everything that really really looks nice how long you had this car Paul I've had it since November of uh, 2020 okay you got it about the same same time I got my car did you yeah oh good for you that was November did no you wait? I'm sorry it was uh, yeah it was November the first week in November I think yeah. it came I ordered mine up 13 months earlier and yeah I was 15 months <laughs> <laughs> yeah we, we both both waited a long time yeah, we know what that's like right for the car oh yeah that's a long wait but well worth the wait i tell oh, you oh yeah it yeah, is yeah. It's, a, it's an excellent car so i had a c7 looks... before this which oh, i thought did. was a fantastic car but this yeah. car is uh is uh, it beats it in every single way how do you feel the c7 compares to the c8 the c7 is a great car the c8 is a little bit better uh in just about every aspect um okay. you know performance handling yeah. comfort um quality of the interior build uh, ergonomically of the way stuff is laid out uh, it's just it's just a great car I love it how long have you had your car Dave since uh, January 21st of this year Wow <laughs> it's looking great and you told me earlier today you had something done to the finish of this car yeah I had a ceramic coated uh, how do you like it I love it yeah the it just stays clean so long yeah, it easier to, and it's easy to clean yeah. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, the paint yeah. looks like it just came. Paint looks like it just came out of the factory. It really does. Yeah. And you like the convertible? I love it. Oh. Love it. <laughs> love it. It's just so easy to put yeah, the top push down. Push the button and down yep. it goes. Just, just a few seconds too, I think. 16 seconds, I 16 think. 16 seconds, Something not like bad. That. Yep. And you can be going what? 20, 30 up miles. Up to up to 30 miles an hour. Up to 30 miles an hour. Yeah. Nice, nice, nice. No. Crazy. The car looks great. I love the red black interior that goes with it. And yeah, the two tone. It just it. looks so nice inside. Yeah. It really, really looks good. Yeah, that really, really looks nice. Thank you, David. Thank you. Nice ride. Love the interior of this car. <clears throat> Ceramic matrix gray metallic with the blue trim seats. Looks absolutely spectacular. And check the wheels out too. Let me go over the side here and give you a look at the wheels. Wheels look great too. Nice looking wheels. I love that interior. Nice, uh, very interesting combination. A beautiful convertible. I was attracted to this car because I love blue Corvettes. <laughs> Blues and reds, but I really love the blue. Tell us a little bit about your car, Steve. Sure, it's uh, 2021 and it's got the Z51 performance package on it. Uh, nice. It's got uh, the GT2 seats, uh, some little upgrades, little cosmetic stuff. But I've only had 400 miles on it, so I'm waiting for the 500 mile. The big 500, yeah. yeah oh, yeah, it, that's fun. Yeah, when I, I get that. But I've already done 100, over 120 with it, just keeping it, at, you know. On a track, of course. Y yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, it looks. I think it's the Wildwood to uh, Fruitland Park track. That track. Oh, yeah. that one. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Listen, it looks great, but I'm looking on the interior here, and it looks a little different than anyone I've seen before. This has got the... Now, what, what color is this interior? Uh, it's the, called the natural. Okay. Yeah. Boy, that looks nice. Yeah, it was... When I ordered it, it was supposed to have, uh, like, black inserts in the center. It was supposed to have been two-tone. Okay. But it didn't come in that way. Oh, re oh yeah, really? Yeah, so... But I still like it. Oh, yeah, it looks great. I love it. I'm gonna, just going to go around the other side here. Sure. Take another look because uh, it's, it's 
There's so many different combinations. That's what's nice about the Corvette. You, yeah. can, you can almost, you can almost personalize your car. Oh yeah, you can big time. Yeah. Sure. There's, there's. And this blue is what color? It's Lake Eckhart blue. Okay. Elkhart Lake blue, something like that. Yeah, something like that. It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Thank you so much. Sure, Thank you're you. welcome. Yeah, it looks great. Thank you. And this one looks beautiful with a red black interior. How long? Two-tone interior. We picked it up May 8th at the National Corvette Museum. Oh, really? Yeah, uh, that was the 607th day after we originally put in the order. Wow. So it took that long uh, to get it. That's a long time. <laughs> yeah, it's a long time. This is our third uh, Corvette in my lifetime. The last wow. one was a C4 decades ago. This car replaces our 488 Ferrari. And I'll, wow. and I'll tell you that this car is every bit the car that the Ferrari was, if not more. Uh, I think you're right. The performance is, is identical, all those are 166 uh, horsepower difference between them. Uh, but 0 to 60, this car is faster than the Ferrari. It is a lot more comfortable than the Ferrari. We picked it up May 8th, um, stayed around for a day or two to go to the track there. Did not drive this car on the track, but drove a Corvette C8 on the track. Yep. And then uh, visited our friend in Nashville, left Nashville at 4 o'clock on May 10th. Just hit the road, drove the car straight through. Wow. Um, we had intended to stop at a number of different places if we wanted to, but when we got to those stop points, looked to her and um, asked her if she was doing okay. Yeah, continue on. So we drove all the way through. Wow. She says it's the most comfortable seat. It's the GT2 yeah, the seats. seats. Are great. Yeah. yeah, the GT2 seats, they are, they are excellent. And I like your choice of rims. The rims look great with the red. I think that's an excellent choice on rims. I really like that. Yeah, almost everything on the car, when we did the selections, uh, we used what we had done on the Ferrari as the, as the guide. Uh, the red calipers and the, the red seat belts, the difference is, is that the red seat belts in the Ferrari cost $1,200. <laughs> oh, geez. These cost a lot less than that. I think yes, it's a lot four, less. I think it's 400 <laughs> And yeah. then because we did a museum delivery, we had the... Uh, we had to uh, select a name for the car to put on that fall there. If you can go in close, you'll see. Now, hopefully, we got that on camera. Yeah, so we call it Sweet Chariot. Uh, it's so far, it's a great car. We've had, uh, let's see, of course, 800 miles to get it home. But then, since then, we've put maybe another 700 on it. Uh, no, no big trips. Uh, just around town here, and it's it's a great car. Uh, it looks great. So let's go over here and meet Art. My, Art, tell us about this beautiful rapid blue car, because it absolutely is gorgeous. Oh, thank you. Yeah, it's a little bit of a color change for me. All the Corvettes I've had previously always usually like a candy apple red. So uh, this year, uh, when we decided to put our order in, GM was pushing this color. My wife, my daughter kind of liked it. So I said, all right, fine. So we, we opted to go with this. Yeah. Uh, I didn't realize how popular the color would become later on. Uh, oh, yeah. You know, now it's used as uh, pace cars for uh, Indy and NASCAR. And a lot of celebrities have bought this color. So it Beautiful turned out color. to be kind of popular. I've had a few blue Corvettes, and this is... Without it up, the most beautiful blue I think I've ever seen on a Corvette. You have an absolutely beautiful ride. It looks like you have Z51. No, actually, this is, this is a, a base LT1. Oh, what is the best? Okay. Yep, it's I got a, it. a base car, base interior, base everything. Boy, it looks gorgeous. Yeah. And I love the black wheels work perfect on the car. Yes. I think. Yes, They're they perfect. do. They do. Yeah, not a lot of uh, not a lot of options. Like I said, it's a, a base car. Uh, originally, my game plan was uh, to keep it for a couple of years and trade yeah. it in on a, on an E-Ray. Yeah, uh, I may still go that way. I'm not 100 percent sure. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, that E-Ray sounds really interesting. Yes, it does. Well, I think even the Z06 sounds interesting. I'm with my friend Larry, who I've known for a while now here in the villages. He's a neighbor of mine, and uh, he's got a beautiful mist what do you call it metallic red mist metallic red mist beautiful beautiful car and i know you've done a few things to this car and well, why don't you tell, tell us about your car uh just little bitty things here and there on the car uh i guess uh 
decals you can see uh yep z51 emblem that's not a oh, yeah, factory that. yeah that's a aftermarket i found online and like the look of it it's kind of set it off a little bit uh interior i did the patches for the embroidery on it oh, nice 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 the color being black and the kind of uh grayish white it needed some color inside so i did ordered the seat belts which are red yeah, oh yeah just to set it off and whatnot yeah. and great looking wheels i like stock uh, wheels i yeah. like the stock wheels well you know i'm gonna it i'll report back to you later there's a company called dip your car that makes a uh, peelable paint but they've changed the peelable paints now and uh i want to dip and change the color of these wheels just play with it because if you don't like it yeah. you just uh peel it off peel it off you know, like do that. it again but it's pretty durable so but the problem i had with it was is i had this car wet sanded when they got it to try to get rid of all the orange peel that gm puts in their cars no charge <laughs> free <laughs> yeah, but it was wet sanded and uh, ceramic coated. When they did that, they ceramic coated the wheels, and that paint won't stick on it. Nothing will oh. stick on that ceramic. So I've got okay. a friend here in the club that we're going to take his car and get it done on Monday, and he's not going to have them do it. We're going to swap wheels. Oh, okay. So I'm going to get some wheels back, and I'll let you know how it turns out that aren't coated so I can start playing with these different colors and whatnot. We were with That's Tony, pretty, pretty and normal. Tony, I have a ceramic uh, matrix gray, gray metallic. Yeah. That's what I have. Okay, and you have the same color. Sometimes it's kind of tricky. I can't tell uh, between that and and uh, white. Well, we were just having a discussion whether that one was white or that, and the lady goes, no, we have a white one, and the white one's over there, so these are both gray. Yours is gray. Yeah. That one's gray. It's <laughs> amazing. Yeah. It's a great color, though. How long have you had the car, Tony? Since the end of January. Since the end of January. Yes. And you got the convertible, which That's I'm sure convertible. you love. Yep. And um, what's, your, what's your favorite yeah. part about the car? There's one thing you had to name that you really, it's over the top. What, what would that be? I think it's the, uh, I got the, the black... Uh, nacelles and roof i think that's the that's what makes the cars the black nacelles and roof yeah i think you're right i love those on the and back the second bit. thing i guess is the morello red interior everybody yep. that sees it says oh that's yep. a great interior i wanted that in my car yeah. and um, i was pricing it out and i said well you know i can go i, I went a little cheap on that I, I bought a lot of other things but i gotta go look at the interior here yeah. walk with me and go over here and, oh yeah this is beautiful so this, in order to get this, you have to go 3LT, right? Yep, so 3LT. And uh, boy, I'll tell you, that kills it. That looks beautiful. Thank you. Absolutely beautiful. When it came into the dealer, the salesman called me and said, your car's in. And he says, everybody at the dealership is salivating over this. Oh, yeah. He said, the gray with the Morello red interior, yeah. he says, you, you killed it. <laughs> it's, a it's a beautiful look. And I think even the stitching, they didn't go red. They kept that. Uh, well, it's a little bit red. A little bit red, yeah. A little bit red, but not bad. But it looks great, boy. Beautiful car. We're with Sid, who is Sid is sitting in his brand, brand spanking new C8 Corvette, 2022, 21. Brand, but brand new. Got how many miles on it? Uh, let's see. 179. 179. 179 and the color the beautiful color what's this color uh, the color is blade silver with the uh red the adrenaline red two-tone interior okay it looks really great now how's it going so far with the car so far good uh 25 miles to the gallon comfortable ride uh, just can't do anything till i get the brake gate complete we met said earlier thank you sid i appreciate you coming in and giving us some time let me before you pull out let me just get a full shot from the front thank you bob all right thank you sid Beautiful silver. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, 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 wow. Very nice. And I like the wheels too. Look at those wheels. Richard. And he's got a beautiful 
What color you got here? It's Arctic white. Arctic white. All right. With the LT3 and... Oh, oh beautiful. And the dipped interior. Uh, the dipped interior, LT3. So that means they do the dash and everything. Mm -hmm. Oh, I hope the color comes out on the camera. This is a tough color to get on the camera, but it looks so beautiful. Oh, my gosh. Kinda What's interesting, and I don't see many, is that we've got Alcantara or suede inserts throughout the car that I don't see in other cars. I see a solid leather. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, isn't that interesting? Isn't that interesting? And even on the headrest, too, right? Even on the headrest. Oh, wow. That is a different look. Wait a minute. <laughs> this really pops. This is really nice. Thank you. So, how long have you had this? I've had this car about eight months. Eight months. This is okay. my second one. I had uh, a 2020, and I couldn't order a hardtop convertible. Uh. So... Uh, I was on a list of two lists, uh, <laughs> one in Florida and one in Texas, and I took the Florida one when it came in, and then uh, when I got the word that I could order my second one, then I pretty much loaded this one up. Yeah, It's beautiful. And happy to get it. We have the pleasure of talking with Joey and Ken, and they have a beautiful, beautiful <laughs> blue... Oh, rapid blue, 20 rapid 20. Blue. <laughs> And boy, this looks rapid too, I'll tell you. It is. And you have a very interesting uh, matching interior. Love it. Looks great, looks great. How long have you had the car? Oh. November. Since last November, November yeah. 15 That's months. That's when I got mine. We ordered it in July of 2019. You waited 15 months. Yep. So did I. <laughs> it was a long wait, wasn't well, it? Worth the wait, yes, it was. <laughs> well, worth it. I say the same thing. You're absolutely right. Uh, everybody a long wait, but yes. but worth the wait. Yeah. Definitely yeah. worth it. So any uh, any particular thing about the car that you like that oh. you want to tell us about? Love everything. Love the handling. Yeah. Typical Corvette handling, only even better, I think. Yeah. I just... <laughs> the steering's just fanat. And, God, you have to watch how you put your foot on it. <laughs> uh, yeah. You can, you, you can lose your license in about 2.8 seconds. Oh, right? yes, you can. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, it looks great, and I thanks for coming by today oh. and sharing your car with everybody. It looks great, and I Thank love the you. rapid, rapid, rapid blue. I love oh. it. It looks great. Love Let me them all. Get a couple of shots. Here. Thank you so much. Thank you.